In the early morning, as the sun began to rise over the hills of Bethany, Jesus Christ and his disciples set out on their journey towards Jerusalem. The road was dusty and winding, bordered by groves of olive trees and the occasional fig tree, their leaves rustling gently in the breeze. As they walked, Jesus felt hunger gnawing at him, and in the distance, he saw a fig tree, its broad leaves promising the sweet taste of ripe figs. He approached the tree, expecting to find fruit beneath its lush foliage. But as he drew closer, he saw that the tree was barren, its branches devoid of any fruit. Jesus gazed at the fig tree for a moment, and then, with a voice full of authority, he said, May no one ever eat fruit from you again. His disciples, puzzled by his words, exchanged glances but said nothing. They continued their journey to Jerusalem, where Jesus spent the day teaching and challenging the practices of the temple. Later, as they returned along the same path, Peter noticed something unusual. The fig tree they had passed that morning was withered from the roots up, its once vibrant leaves now shriveled and lifeless. Astonished, Peter pointed it out to the others and said, Rabbi, look! The fig tree you cursed has withered. Jesus turned to his disciples and said, Have faith in God. Truly, I tell you, if anyone says to this mountain, Go, throw yourself into the sea, and does not doubt in their heart but believes that what they say will happen, it will be done for them. Therefore I tell you, whatever you ask for in prayer, believe that you have received it, and it will be yours. The disciples marveled at the power of their master, realizing that his words were not merely commands, but lessons in faith and the authority of belief. As they walked on, the withered fig tree stood as a silent reminder of the deeper truths Jesus was teaching them, a symbol of the importance of bearing fruit in one's life and the power of unwavering faith.